Hi, welcome to Addie B's Bling. I hope you guys are having a great evening. I am here on a Saturday night. What are you guys doing on this Saturday night? I've done all my cleaning for today, so I am working on um, another project for my um, business. Tonight, I'm going to create a bling folder, as you can see here in the description. So. Um, Make sure you guys give me the thumbs up when you come in or if you're listening to the um, to the live. Also, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. Again, this is Eddie B's Bling channel. So I hope you guys, um, hope you, like I say, I hope you guys are having a great I am. So um, I've seen other people make one. So I, I thought I, I, trying to get my camera adjusted here. I thought I would try it. So. This will be easier, like when you're out and about. If you want to take, um, if you want to take your jury to, um, to work or to any events and stuff like that, it'll be easy to carry instead of trying to, um, you know, take a, a bunch of different bags and stuff like that. So I am going to show you guys what I picked up from the store. Um, I mean, so you guys didn't know exactly what um, what I was using, but I'll just go over it real quick. All right, I got this. Um, I got this three ring binder. It's just a white binder. You can get any color you want. It's a thick, um, the thick binder. Because I didn't want to work. Maybe I'll use that to put like some necklace or something in. But again, it is a three ring. All you have to do is pick up a, a three ring binder. That, um, hopefully, you will get the size that they have. Um, I also picked up these I also picked up these uh, baseball card sleeves these for like um, either baseball cards or um, you know how the kids have the Pokemon cards and all that stuff all it is is you just slide your you know it has each 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 um, thing has a, an opening this is at the top because it's the top um, it is the top one and these here, you just slide whatever you're gonna put in in there because they're they're six, six nine. You can put nine items in this one sleeve. So let's see how it's gonna work. Actually, already started. <clears throat> I had already started a sleeve earlier, so I just show you guys um, what I, what I've done so far, or you know, I just show you how to do it. See, I have here. Already three sets, three pair of earrings. And what I did was, that's right quick. You just take the baseball, the baseball sleeves, and uh, okay. First, I have um, I have the binder. I have the ear baseball sleeves, and I've seen people do it with the the little Velcro circle. So. <clears throat> I might try that. That be, might be a little bit more inexpensive than using these. What I have is these little, these little fasteners. If you guys can see it, you can get them from the dollar store, or you can get them from Hobby Lobby or anywhere like that. So all you do is just, it's just a little thing that you open it up and you can fasten it that way. Or, <clears throat> like I say, if you want to use the, um, if you want to use the Velcro dots, I'll probably pick up some of those. I didn't even think about that, but I just thought of these. I just thought of these little um, holders because I already had them at home, but it probably would be um, easier to do it with the, um, to do it with the Velcro because this you have to take it out. Um, see like this, like I've already have one in here. Oops, I already have one in here. Uh, it's, it's quick and easy though. So you just take it off the, you know, you can just unfold it. And just take it out if someone wanted to see the jewelry, if someone wanted to actually take it out of the pack. But it'll be easier with the Velcro. Now, now that I see, you know, I see why some people use the um, some people use the Velcro. So um, let me show you what I did. So all you do is you just take whatever you want to put in here. I've got um, I got a um, couple pair of earrings just to show you guys how you know how I did it. So what you want to do, you want to make sure that 
when you put it in, you put the earring facing the the side where you're gonna um, um, where you're gonna insert the uh, the plastic onto the binder because you don't you don't want to have it on um, backwards. You probably could get two in there, but I wouldn't do it. So I'm just gonna put the earring in the. <laughs> you got to make sure that they'll fit in there and they are the right size. You probably can get, I'm not sure if you can get a bigger size. Um, I'm not sure if you can get a bigger size uh, card holder or something like that. If you want to put, see, I, see how I have it in there? I already got one pair of earrings. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to take one of these little, um, one of these little fasteners. I was trying to pick a color to match, <laughs> but I guess it doesn't matter. So I was going to take one of these little fasteners and all I'm going to do, because this is, this plastic is thin plastic. Put it, I'm just going to punch it through. It'll, it'll go right, wait, it should go right through because I did it earlier. Which it never fails when you try to show <laughs> show somebody something that doesn't um, work the way it's supposed to. But anyway, all you do is just poke. Um, you just push it right through and it, it, it will go right through, but you, you should hold it because sometimes you might have to give it a little, I guess that's why it would be easier to use the Velcro because the Velcro, you would just put it, then you just put the little dots on each side and you just close it together. So actually I'm going to go and pick up some of those now that I, I see that it'll be easier to do it. But if you guys have already have these fasteners around the house and you want to use those, see is how quick and easy it is. I just put the little fastener in there. And that is the back. And all you do is just close the, you just close the back and it will not fall out. So if you want to keep, you know, if you want to create earrings in the, um, hopefully you guys can see. It. Okay. If you put a bunch of earrings in the, in the holders and you don't secure the top of it with a, um, with a Velcro dot or one of these little fasteners, um, there's a chance if you have your, your tote upside down that the, you know, see that the, the jewelry will the jury will fall out. So you want to make sure that you have something to hold the um that you have the something to hold the jury in there. Like one of like I say, you can either use these little fasteners, or which would be quick and easier if you use the Velcro dots. So that's the lesson learned. This is my first time doing it. Hopefully somebody else is watching it. Um, you know, you, you'll, you'll be like, oh, yeah, I'd rather use the, the Velcro dots. It'll be a whole lot, you know, it'll be a whole lot easier because with this, you have to actually punch the. There you go. That is what I'm creating. I have um, this. You can, like I say, you can take this to work. You can take it out to the, um, you can take it out to the park and stuff like that. If you go to Starbucks and or, or wherever and you just sitting there having coffee and, you know, you have your have your your, your bling folder open and something like that, and people may um, inquire what it is or what you're doing, and that way you can make some money while you're sitting there. So all you do is you know, just like in high school, you just fold the um, you just put the the plastic into the you just close you just close the binder up. So this is how this is how it's going to look when I get done. Hopefully you guys can see it. Let's see. This is how it's going to look when I get done. I'm going to have, like I say, it, it holds nine items. I'm going to do um, mostly earrings, I guess, in the smaller compartments. And all it was, in addition to getting the, the baseball card, in addition to getting the baseball cards, um, sleeves, I also got, you can also get, I wish I had it kept the the paper, but you can insert like photos and stuff like that. And this has one, two, three, four. This one only has four compartments, but you can see that the compartments are bigger. But um, if you wanted to put, I should have grabbed a, a bracelet. If you wanted to put bracelets or or um, necklaces in, you can. So matter of fact, let me just see, because like I said, this is my first time, this is my first time doing it. Uh, you know what? I'm trying to adjust this. <laughs> I'm trying to adjust this, this hair and this shirt because it keeps uh, getting tangled. But this is, like I say, this is a photo sleeve. And this one has, they come, I think I paid for the baseball card, you get 10 get 10 or more sleeve it was 397 and also for the um 
for the photograph sleeve, these are, I think these were also $3.97, but you probably could, but I will look um, when I go to the dollar store to see if, um, if they have them also. You know, every penny counts, especially when you're trying to um, start a business and, you you know, you realize that you constantly have to buy, you know, you constantly have to cut corners wherever you can. So I have a, um, as far as the necklaces, um, I guess if you want, you can just put the, um, I have this, um, as you can see, I have this paparazzi necklace here. Just in case if you guys are interested in purchasing anything from me, you can check out my website. I will put it. Um, I will put it here in the description or in the uh, comments when I'm with the with the live because I'm not sure why I didn't do that uh, beforehand. So if you want, um, you can take um, your paparazzi jewelry. As you can see, I have on one of my paparazzi rings, and of course, everything is five dollars. <laughs> everything is lead and nickel free. You can check me out. You can check out my website. And if you have a tag on it, like the paparazzi tag, you can always make sure that the tag is facing you so you know when you close the binder that that will be showing first. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to hold this. Like I say, if you want to just do the necklace like that, you can. And you just push the little, you just push the little fastener through. And there you go. And that holds the necklace in, in place. And like I was saying, if you guys want to check out my website and, you know, there you can shop 24 hours a day, seven days a week, nonstop. Just like if you want to get up in the middle of the night, you know how people do the, um, what do you call it? When they um, be showing all infomercials and all, all stuff like that, you're buying stuff all, you know, all type of day and night. So if you want to um, shop 24 seven, you can at my website. We have a, um, I have a ton of uh, on my uh, Facebook page where I usually do a live once or twice a week. So make sure you follow me on, um, okay. So make sure you follow me at Addie, Addie B's Bling. On, you see all the fabulous jewelry that I have. And if you don't see anything on the, um, if you don't see anything on the live that I'm doing, you can always shop on the website. So I will put the website here when I'm done with um, trying to show you guys how to do this. Oh, you did? Okay. So I took, I'm taking this out now because you see when I had it in, I had it in like that. So like I say, you can put in, you can put a necklace, you can put in bracelets on the side and you can, you know, put in additional uh, items if you would like. But what I'm going to show you, I'm going to try to put it on. So I'm going to try to make it a little bit more presentable. I don't have my, um, my ruler here in front of me. So I'm just going to try to eye this <laughs> as I cut it. I have here is, is you can pick this up from, um, probably Walmart or, um, or the dollar store, you know, if you, I think the dollar store, I'm not sure if they actually sell it pre-cut already. You know, if you want to sit there and you know, cut it up, you can. So this is going to fit. <clears throat> it'll fit. It'll fit this way. So I could do it this way, or I could actually turn it to the side and try to cut it and make it fit. So let me see if I can. Let me see if I can do it just by eyeing it. I'm not gonna even. Um, I'm not gonna even. I'm not gonna even try to measure it because I don't know where my. I don't know where my rule is. So this is just an uh, impromptu. <laughs> this is just to make the like. If you have necklace, I got. I'm just gonna try to make it look a little bit more presentable. I mean, you can if you want to. If you want to take the time, because you can make your bling bag. You know, look any way you want because it's your bag. So. That you see how that is. Had I, had I measured it, I could have cut it all the way over to the side, but I got a little bit here on top, which I, I can just cut that, cut that down. Try not to cut the plastic though. <laughs> just cut the. Um, well, once I do this, and once I get it cut, what I'm going to do to make it look a little bit more presentable, I'm going to cut two slits in the top of it. What I'm gonna do, I'm going to put the necklace on the on, on the cardstock so it'll look just a little, it'll look a little bit more presentable. So I'm just gonna put it through the um put it through the little slits. Hold on. 
I gotta figure out a way to, to, to put the earrings. Oh, you know what? I know what I can do. So there's the necklace. The necklace is gonna be gonna be trial and error. <laughs> this is me on a Saturday night <laughs> trying to think of um, other ways to you know do stuff for my business. So okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put the, the necklace. You know what you can do if you want. I think it will look a whole lot better. What I'm going to do, I'm going to actually, I'm actually going to take if I can find where the clasp is to, to take it off. <laughs> so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to take it off, and there's the earrings and the necklace separate. Just close the necklace back up. I'm gonna try to put it on the um, because these these necklaces have the um, extended chain. Like if you want to wear it long or smaller, but what I'm doing since I'm trying to put it on this cardstock and put it in the bag. I'm going to put it really all the extra uh, ex excess of the chain will drop in the back. So here we go. Let's try this again. Hopefully you guys can see what I'm doing. I'm just going to put the necklace. I'm just going to put the necklace on the card stock. And the back of the necklace is just going to hang. It'll just be in the back of the um, back of the pack. So. Let me show you guys. I'm gonna just put it in there. Of course, like I say, it's not cut. <laughs> it's not cut the, the right way because I didn't actually measure it. So if that'll just hang down. That'll just hang down in the back, the ex excess, or you can you can adjust it. <laughs> I'm dropping it. You can adjust it where you can see more of the necklace at the bottom. So let's see. Oh. All right. There's the necklace that do look, look a little better. I think I cut it down too far. First time trial and error, I'll, I'll do it. Um, I'll do a better looking job. But anyway, here's the earrings. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put the earrings. Now this may be, if you happen to have whole, um, if, you, if you buy uh, 12 or more accessories, you get the third. In this case, since I took the earrings off of the necklace, and it's, it'll be a little harder to to hold through since I put the card in there. So this is trial and error. Let's see how this is gonna go. Let's see if I can get let's see if I can get this right. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna hold this at the top. I'm gonna hold it. I'm gonna hold the earrings at the top. And by I'm gonna turn it, I had to turn it to face me so I can actually see it. And what I'm gonna do since it's at the top of the make to my friend, it's at the top of the pack if you guys can see the hole. And I'm gonna take my hole puncher. And I'm going to just punch a hole with a, see that? It went it went straight through. So, I mean, if you want to take the time to do that, I'm just doing it because I already had these little fasteners. But I, I don't think with the um, with the Velcro dots that you can put the card stock in there. I don't know. I'm going to have to try it out and see. See, and that's how it looks. That's how it looks. I think that's why it's a little white. But that's how it looks. That is the necklace. If you want to put it on, if you want to put it on some cardstock so it'll show the necklace um, better. I mean, I, I have to fix it better in in the. Um, I have to fix it in the plastic. So, um, for the you can get the the um, the picture size. You can get the picture size uh, plastic, and you can do it like that. You can you can you know make you can you can measure out the cardstock because it tells you what size it, it tells you on the packet when you buy the um, plastic what size it is. But I've already thrown it away, so I can't even actually tell you what size it is. But if you go to Walmart over where they sell like the um, paper and scissors and all that stuff, the school supplies, you will find this. You'll find it right next to right next to the baseball card so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna put the necklace in the bigger bag in the bigger pocket and maybe i'll put a bracelet on the side so i'll have a um different variety in my bling folder here so and i like big bulky jewelry in there so like when you put too much stuff in the in the folder then the 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 plastic hit <laughs> the plastic will start ripping and stuff like that so you don't want to have it too you don't want to have it too heavy all right, just make sure that the back stays stays down, and make sure that your make sure that your binder is closed, so that way your stuff won't fall out. 
<laughs> and so once I get this full, this is exact. This is how it's gonna look. Let me try to turn this camera to the side a little bit more. All right. So this is how it's gonna look. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna have. I'm gonna put the earrings in the front. I'm gonna have. Um, like I say, you get nine. You get ten sheets, and there's nine pockets on each sheet so you can get a whole lot of earrings so if you want to you can just make one binder i mean depending on how big you want to make your your bling bag i haven't um, done that yet I, I ordered a bag but i ordered a, a smaller bag so i think i'm gonna have to get a, a bigger bag but if, if in order for i mean for your bling for your bling folders like i say make sure that you get the the thick one the thick one like that so if you want to do um if you want to do more than one, you can make one binder. Or I mean, if you feel like carrying that stuff around, depending on where you're going, like I say, if you're going to, an, it is um, easier to do it like that. Um, instead, unless you don't want to carry around, you know, carry around your pegboards and stuff, they're not going to carry them. So this would be easier if you um, at like a school function or something for your kids. You can just take your bling. You can take your bling binders. You can make three big binders. You make three binders. You can make one binder. One binder can have all earrings if you want to do it like what I'm going to do. I have two binders because I think I want to have one binder for just earrings. And then the, the next binder that I'm going to do, I'm going to have necklace. I'm going to put the necklace and bracelets in. So that, that'll be, um, and try, and I'm going to try to use like um, thin bracelets and necklace and stuff like that because if it's too bulky, um, so you want Oh, like I say, and if you put too much stuff in there and it gets too heavy, then because this this um, plastic is lightweight, I'm not sure. You probably can find heavier plastic, but this is the um, least expensive, I should say, uh, plastic. So it may may rip easy if you have too much stuff in there. So make sure if you want to, you can look and see if you can find a heavier plastic. If not, you can just get, I mean, to start off, like I say, you can just get this from Walmart. So I'm going to work on binder. This one be all earrings. So it shouldn't be that heavy when I'm done with it. And when I get ready to do my, um, when I get ready to do my, my, uh, my bling bag, um, I can just, you can just put these, you, you know, if depending on how big your bag is, you can just sit these down in your bag and, you know, if somebody wants to see your stuff, it's easy. You just pop it out and it is, is easy and accessible to get. It takes like a second to pop out this, um, this little fastener, but I think I'm going to try the, which will be even faster to get in and out. I am going to try the Velcro, um, the little Velcro dots. I think that'll be, a, um, that'll be better, but I don't think if you have the Velcro dots, the Velcro dots is just going to hold your, um, it's going to hold your stuff in. It'll probably, it probably won't look. Let me see. Let's see. Because if you have the fastener, do hold the um, hold the earrings up so you can see them. But if you have the Velcro dot, I'm, a, I'm thinking if you put the Velcro dot, well, I guess it don't really matter. If you put the Velcro dot, your stuff would just be laying like that. So it don't really matter as long as they can be, you know, long as they can see the, <laughs> long as they can see the product. So that's my video for tonight. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, give me the thumbs up. Um, Continue to watch, uh, continue to like, continue to share. Also, um, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if this is your first time watching. Also, you can follow me again. You can follow me on Instagram and you can follow me at Addie B's Bling on Facebook. Like I say, on um, once a week, I'll do a live video on Facebook so you guys can see what I am selling. Um, a whole lot more stuff on the website that I don't do on live. So. Also, there is, um, like I said, everything is $5. Everything is lead and nickel free. The Z collection, those items are $25. They are the um, the, the, the more bigger and bulkier, um, like jewelry and stones and stuff like that. They're very pretty. The Z collection, they're, they're some very, very beautiful pieces. They look super expensive, and I believe they're only $25. So, But as far as the rest of the necklace and stuff like that, they are $5. Everything is lead and nickel free. We also have, um, um, I also have on the site, there is a, um, a, man's, uh, a man's thing. I think it's called Urban 
what is it called? It's called Urban. Uh, uh, I think it's the, the Urban feature or something for men. They do have men stuff on it. They have like the um, the bead bracelets. Um, I have one right here. I can show you guys. They have like the bead bracelet for men. They have, um, well, this isn't a bead bracelet. This is, a, I think I have one. They have like the leather cuffs. They have like, look at this. This looks like a, an expensive gold rope necklace. So they have they have the gold the gold rope necklace. They have uh, silver rope. They have um, they also have the bracelet that comes with them. They have um, some men rings, some beautiful men rings. So make sure you guys check that out if you're looking for something for your guy or guy and fellas. If you're actually watching this live, you can also go on there also because a lot of people think when we say paparazzi jewelry they think it's only jewelry for women but we do have stuff for men so make sure that guys you check that out and i will talk to you guys later i hope everybody having a, a fantastic evening and again uh, make sure you like share and subscribe to the channel make sure you check me out on my other social media platforms on um instagram and at facebook so Again, that um, that was my my short, well, not really short video. I'm going to put in here. Um, I can either put in my paparazzi sign, or I'm working on my. I'm working on getting myself a logo. And when I get get my logo, I'm gonna put my logo here because all it does, you can just, you know, just like regular high school notebooks, you can just slide. You can just slide your, you know, where you can print out pictures, and you can just make yourself a. I don't know what size this is. You can make yourself an eight by 10 or something like that. And you can just slide it down in there. You can do all kinds of stuff. You can bling it out if you want to. <laughs> you can put all stones on it. But maybe I'll come back and let you guys see the finished product one day once I get uh, get done because I'm working on that. I'm also working on a, um, a hanging rolling pegboard that I got to paint tomorrow. So again, thanks guys for watching. Um, I hope you guys are having a pleasant evening. As you see, I got on a couple of pair of my... Um, paparazzi rings here each each like i say it's five bucks you don't have to worry about if it um, fits your finger or not because all the bands are stretchy material matter of fact let me take it off i said i'm gonna do selling on on here yet just yet but gotta get get my audience built up so you don't have like i say you don't have to worry about that because all the rings are stretchy so Anyway, I comments and I will check it out later. All right, have a great evening. Until next time, please be safe.